all right what's up guys i am back unfortunately i've been very busy studying so i've not been able to upload as much but yeah starting off with a master tier game a new vest it's a really really annoying matchup for yone just because like silas has so much sustain and low cooldowns that you cannot deal with that at most stages of the game so honestly trying to not taking too many awful trades like if we can avoid trading that's even better if you have to trade you have to go for like extended ones short trades are really bad because he just out sustains it basically means that you allow him to w and if you go for short trade then you just or he will have his w up again in the next trade so you're just going to auto lose so you have to like all in this champ but even that cannot be very good early on because he just has higher damage and maybe i should not play ranked when it's like my first game of the day as i can definitely feel it when i you know move around and also see us and stuff have a gang coming in taking up q Okay, nice flash down. That's a good gank. Please don't mess up my way, man. I'll, I'll need to set up a slow pusher thing so I can help him with this call crap when it's about to spawn soon. I don't think he will be needing help, but let's see. Interesting. Three minutes and nobody dead. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Well, that's good for us, I guess. And now Seraphine just ends it? What? Like, is this W that makes him pretty problematic in this matchup? That's the only annoying thing is that he just perma heals up. So, taking short trades is probably the worst thing you can do. Unless he's low HP, of course. Anti healing could be huge. Graves is nearby. That's why I'm not playing as safe. I'm not letting a W me. He's coming. Like, even if you know the enemy jungler is coming up, it's fine to play aggressive if your jungler is close to you and you think you can win the 2 versus 2. Normally we don't, but because like Silas was low HP from that gank, it will work out easily. Cause I would just ignite him, you know. And also wait using your third Q until he used the first part of his C. Oh my days, bro. What is happening? If I lose the cannon, he's losing that too. Diego spot still? What? Why? Trying to cap my bot lane? We have a Seraphine, so... Yeah, we have some scaling on our end, but man, I don't like our comp, honestly. I really don't like that Renekton pick, because if it does not work out in the early game, he gets outscaled so fast, man, it's insane. Just perma poking him behind minions. And you see when, if you let him heal up, guys, like... Just gonna stay, keep it here. At least he loses a couple minions. He does have ignite, so we need to respect that. We just wait for our E to come up. Graves is also headed towards us. I think he's going for the chickens. Like, he has to decide between queuing. If he queues the minions, he might end up pushing the wave. We can just zone him like this, we don't have to push it. He's level 6 too. Okay, he took my ultimate. I was trying for a gang again. Renekton has to watch out. I'm not gonna go in on that. That would be pretty bad.
Nice. I had lethal tempo because I need the early game benefits against really bad matchups, but this ultimate is down. Luckily, I hit that one, otherwise, I think that could have ended pretty bad. I play a ward here. Because I'm going to reset, he's going to be back in lane before me, so I want to see if he's trying to roam or not. I think Silas might, or uh, Vieco might think about coming bot. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Watch out, bot lane. Please watch out. Should I go for seal? No. I don't want it. I cannot afford to wait for the refillable right now. I need to get back to lane ASAP. Plus, my bot lane is low HP, right? So they might think about going a four man bot. And if he shows it in, they could easily attempt a four man bot with Silas. They're winning pretty hard CS, so that's huge. Need to get some vision down. Gonna kill this one. I need to help Graves. I'm moving. They could try to flank me, so you also have to be careful when you try to help. He's here. But that's what I meant. Like when you try to help somebody, they could easily flank you while you're moving, right? So be careful. I could have killed him here, but like Silas was coming too, and he does have ignite up, I think. Or maybe it might be down. Because he did ignite the graves. But we also have lots of healing. They do as well. I'm gonna fix the wave if our jungle is trying to force something. Otherwise, I'm gonna try to like push it a bit slower. Um, okay. Soraka. Nice one, bro. Right, they have a global ultimate now. It's honestly annoying you cannot ping which ultimate he has. They... No, 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 no. Like, it would be nice if you can pick, uh, ping Silas ultimate and does it show? No, it does not. And it would be so nice if you can ping when he has taken an ultimate and show which one they have. He might be doing the Drake. Oh no. Ah, oh, that's so terrible, man. What? That is so terrible, bro. I cannot help. Is he going this way? He's going for the Drake. Yeah, that blows. That's such a disaster, man. Like he's doing the Drake now and we can't do anything about it sadly. Because Graves is topside, so if I try to contest it right now, I'll get collapsed on by the Silas and I'll die 100 percent Just take his chickens then. He'll probably cover top, but I also want to make sure I have a Good CS lead. An enemy has been slain. Your team has destroyed a turret. Following up. Wait, is this guy Max in Q? No there is no time. He actually Max in Q? No, he's not. Or maybe he might be, because he doesn't deal that much damage to minions right now. I think it's a bit too late to get the refillable, honestly. We have sustain now. 
But we got two towers top side, that's fine. Pretty decent CS lead. This guy's playing so passive, man. Like, it's a Silas one trick, Master here. How does he not know how hard he storms your name? Maybe he's just scared of getting ganked. Plus, their jungler is playing a lot around their bot. I'm gonna get some vision. Yeah, he's bot again. Classic. Nice. Okay, that's fine so far. Like, they're doing fine, honestly. We just don't have AD carry. I mean, technically, I am, but not a ranged one. Graves also doesn't really count, but he's a more of a bruiser with the build they're going nowadays. Oh, he's bought again, what a surprise. Come on, ult me. Lol. <laughs> he's dead now though. I'm gonna have a stack queue ready. Oh my god, bro. Really, man? That's so disgusting. Yeah, I'm gonna buy the anti healing. That's my bad for not having it, so. Okay, nice. What? <laughs> Both of us trolled with the ultimates. They should try, turn on Diego. I have anti healing now. It's my bad for not having it. Wow. Oh, okay, we're getting carried. We'll take it, man. Let the Rune King is so good here, man. Like, he gets a bit tanky, but especially Diego and Mundo. It's super tanky. Gonna help a ton. Well gone. Oh, okay. Damage, bro. What? Nice. That might just try to flank me. The wave. He could come around here, so that's why. Yeah. Nice one. Nice one. I just want to get to the side lane where it's a lot harder for him to play safe. Lol, she flashed. That just made it super worth it. They actually flashed away, what? <laughs> He's dead now, right? Please get him. Keep it on. Wow. I did not like the Renekton pick, but this guy is doing insane. Like, he's actually doing great. I don't have anything up to help. Alright, it's fine. A good thing is that I'm actually not that reliant on potions that now that we have Seraphine and a Soraka. And they don't have anti-healing. What a classic man. You just cannot make AD carry players by anti-healing. How do you not have that? They actually don't have anti-healing against a Soraka and Seraphine. I should go bot. Lol. Question mark? I think Renekton goes spot now. 
Just let me buy this. Bum is great, honestly. Like, we're not getting many kills, but we're stomping him CS wise. That's something. I had to go bot. I need to match, and I also want to be able to pressure now. Now that I have that item I need. Diego could be hovering bot side. Oh, there he is. down. Don't need the ultimate now. Play the Rune King to OP. You know, this guy is a on one trick. And we banned it. It's not like he's running it down, but at least he let our Rune X and Snowball. Alright. Oh, the Herald did not get the last hit in. Okay. We're getting the bot sides out. Also, that anti healing helped out a ton, honestly, in the fights. I could go over here and attack him again. Let me fix the wave. I'm fine. Also, taking out this blast gun is huge, man. Like, you make it so much harder for the enemy jungler to make plays. Like, to quickly get around wards. I'm gonna take this away probably next time. We don't have TPs, that's the only problem. Not gonna go for the Bruiser build. Because I want the damage against that team. I just want to be able to shred whoever is trying to... One versus one me in the silence. When we met in the spirit realm, this other color upon my face knew me. Let's watch out around here. Well, there they are. Of course they're there. And take the safe way around here to ward. Just to give our mid some vision. I'm gonna keep pushing bot side because we are winning one versus one now. There's a point where Silas will actually still win against you because of the healing. I have to move up. I fight the starting. I'm here. He does not want that. No, 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 no. Okay, that's fine. My team was here in time. Luckily, we have so much healing, man. I can actually troll and still not die. Which is usually never the case when you play squishy champs like these. I want to do the flash ult because like his E and everything was down. If I hit him with the ultimate, he would have died. But you know how it goes when you use your ultimate without anything else in advance. If you don't set up your ultimate with all the CC, it's really hard to hit it. If they have vision of you at least. Blue is coming up. Could be dead, right? Okay, never mind. I think we're fine. Mundo, we can actually fight. Oh. Wow. Wow, that's some Seraphine mechanics, bro. Bro, come on, man. Let me have something. I know you guys are caring, but still, let me get something at least. Honor, once bound to all else. Can we do that? I think it's gonna take a long time for me to make it up there. 
I just do the Drake then. I made it really tanky, right? Like hard to take down for one person. I really hope they don't need me. Like the bot lane is not moving, so they should be fine. Should be over. Like this one should be done. We haven't done much if I had to be honest, but man, I think we did well in the lane. And also farm is great, so we're gonna skill up anyways. No fate, no Has to walk away here so that he cannot see. I'm still here because of the minion buffs. Don't hold me, man. Good. I've walked it once before. They could be camping in here. Not. I want to reset. Uh, that's not even a point in Lux using her ultimate unless it's for a kill. Like to poke, Soraka just heals back up. Just want to stack Q, then I can go in. I have to watch out for the Lux Q mainly. Bro, I'm just a support at this point. I'm actually a support. Should be absent. If we also buff up the top side minions. The one who has to buy anti-healing is complaining. Hilarious AD carry mains, but it is. First game in a week, I think. 